Live from Kern County Streaming News Leader. This is 23 ABC News at 11, and it starts now. The Jehovah's Witnesses Convention is still ongoing in the Mechanics Bank Arena, bringing people from all over the state and continuing to bond with each other over the words of the Bible. 23 ABC's Ruby Rivera spoke with people about their incredible journey of going from ex-con to devoted Jehovah's Witnesses and tells us what the Bible means to them. Love, freedom, and hope. That's how Alfonso Castellon and Willie Hernandez describe the power of the Bible. After being in prison for years, they say the Bible gave them a second chance at life, something they are truly grateful for and say they now feel their lives have meaning. My past, it, you know, I felt like I wasn't worthy and it, that led to me not be able to move past that. But getting to know God helped me overcome those challenges. Member of Jehovah's Witnesses Willie Hernandez says after struggling with drug abuse for years, he wanted to find a way to turn his life around, but more importantly, give back to his family. He says not only did the Bible teach him that, but it also taught him how to let go of his past and grow from it. Member of Jehovah's Witnesses Alfonso Castellon shares the same mindset as Hernandez. Castellon started abusing drugs at age 16 and continued for the next 28 years. He says going to prison forced him to become sober, which he says eventually led to him taking back control over his life. Change is hard. Uh, the main thing that I learned is with being a Jehovah's Witness is that uh, the Bible taught us how to forgive one another and to be there to support one another. So when I got out of prison, I had a support group. And the support group was my fellow believers. Local spokesman for Jehovah's Witnesses, Sean Delita, says these are the principles that Jehovah's Witnesses are based off of and describes them as more of a family. The community that we have here is amazing. The, the way we come together, the way we enjoy each other's company, and the support group that we have, it, it's outstanding. Hernandez says the Bible has helped him in more ways that he thought possible, and says while he's regained faith, he's also gained a family. Never did I think I would, and I am so grateful to be here. And I thank God on a daily basis, because if I didn't have God in my life, it wouldn't be possible. Castellon and Hernandez say by devoting themselves to the words of the Bible, they were given the chance to become better family men and also have a new perspective on life. Castellon is now the owner of his own air conditioning business and Hernandez is a maintenance technician. And they say they're happier than they've ever been. In downtown Bakersfield, for Beer Vera, 23 ABC News, connecting you.